She's passionate. Oh my god. Dave literally just saw Rose in the kitchen and was like, oh, hello there, baby. Double trouble babies. I love them. Hello there, honey buns, and welcome back to another episode of my not so very challenge. In the previous video, we did have some exciting stuff happen. Zari and Dave actually headed on to GeekCon where Zari got to ride on a rocket ship, which is her dream. You know, she's been building the one in her backyard for a lot of time now. Actually, all of her teenhood ever since Mint gave it to her, and now she's trying to upgrade it. Also, I'm gonna continue to work on this Nerd Brain Aspiration. I'm gonna do all I can. I'm not sure if I can get my logic skill up to level 10 in this video, but we'll see what we can do. And fix or upgrade 5 objects, we'll be upgrading our rocket ship. And also, I have to mention that in 3 days, Zari is going to be aging up into a young adult, which means that I will actually be moving her out. I've already built a house for her in a way this spring. We just have to have enough funds to get her there. In fact, let me just quickly see how much money it was before we continue. Okay, so her house is actually 46,000. Let's say 47. And maybe 48 so that she has like enough money. Oh my god. This is gonna be tough. If you're still enjoying this series, be sure to give a big cheeky thumbs up. And also, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you never miss any videos. Because we're going to stick some soon. It's gonna be out of this world. Look at her, she's feeling flirty because she had a steamy shower. A hot and steamy shower makes you feel so good. She feels nice from the warm fire and blushing. Okay, so this is actually the final day. I'm going to continue grinding on her skills. The skills that I need to work on are rocket science, handiness, logic, and fitness. All of those for her career and as part of this challenge because I do need to complete my aspiration so the logic skill is a one for sure. Okay, you're feeling flirty and you're going to craft a knife block. Okay, I was kind of hoping that you can work on your rocket ship, but since you're already like going there and this house is huge, fine. In fact, after you do that, you know what you could do? You could craft some furniture that we can sell because we do need money for your house. So what is the first thing that you can try to do? Why don't you try garden pot? That sounds real cute. Oh, but also you wanted to do your knife block, so do that too, okay? Okay, feeling flirty and doing this doesn't seem right, but you should be careful. By the way, I love her so, so much, but this is probably the last time she'll be wearing this hair because when she turns into a young adult, I will be giving her different things. Look at how cute she is working on her thing. Okay, enjoying the view of Del Sol Valley for the last few days of her teenagehood. Of course, she's going to be coming back, I mean... We're not gonna leave Rose and Dave high and dry. Lily Berry is wondering if you want to go over at her house and hang out. No. But you can come here until Dave comes back. What do you say? I can actually turn on a light. It's all light again, okay guys? This is a pretty pretty house now because I'm not gonna be paying another Monday. I'm not gonna be staying that long, so thank God. Why does she still feel free? What? Rose rubbed off on you a little bit after all. She's passionate. Oh my god. She's doing what I love, which is crafting stuff. Okay, she has it in her inventory now. Can I see it? Can I see it? Uh, what is it supposed to be? Okay, by the way, look, our life space squid from the previous episode from the from space, technically. Okay, let's leave it like on the top shelf so that it can't run away. Oh my gosh, look at it. What on the earth? It's not on Earth, but you know. Oh, it's been placed in the household inventory. There it is. She made it excellent. And it's 60 simoleons. So go in ahead and sell it. Yay. Good job. Actually, I don't know if I should have made her do it by herself, but... You know, it is what it is. I'm actually on the third level of fitness skill, and I've never actually saw her swim in this pool, so... Can you come and swim some laps? Although Rose is coming upstairs to talk. See, Rose, you're also in a bikini, so come along. By the way, she's got another space print that she is going to sell. Because we need the money. And also, we need to upgrade this rocket ship. But at the same time, it does cost a lot. And I want her to upgrade her own rocket ship. So, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Let me just see. Okay, her rocket science is on level 8. Her logic is on level 6. Six. Her fitness is on level 3, but where's her handiness? Oh, handiness is level 5. Okay, what else can I do? I can upgrade objects. Let me see. Okay, they're still heading downstairs to go and swim. Like, what? Okay, who? This is Lily. Lily, what are you doing 
heading on to Dave's bedroom. Oh, you're heading to the computer. You know what? Just bye. Dave has come feeling tense from work. He needs to, he needs a break. Oh, poor baby. Okay, Rose, go do your thing. Okay, Zarya is also confident from being pretty handy. After that demonstration of handiness, Zarya is feeling pretty good. Oh, Jay's here. Hey, I got a special gift for you because you're such a good neighbor and I appreciate your kindness and friendship. Of course I want to see it. And why is she bugged? Swim! Uh, she is swimming, but apparently she's not swimming. Yeah, she's working on her fitness so. though. Hello there, JS! Come on in! By the way, she does want to win a game of chess. So I'm kind of wondering, Jay, you're here. Wanna play some chess with me? I've played with a lot of people, but I haven't played with you. Oh my god, look, like she has to come through here to go here to open the door because Gate is here. Okay, there you go, Jay. You can give me your gift and then we can go play. In fact, if Jay is up for it, we could slide a little bit because Rose loves doing that. She also loves Dave and yeah. Oh, she's really focused. Baby Zari, not so baby anymore. Playing against her uncle Jay. By the way, I saw that Leinani and Justin's child has been born, which means we need to go down and meet them. We definitely do. By the way, I gave a makeover to all of Prisha and Jay's children in the previous episode. You can go ahead and see if you haven't already. She wants to win a game of chess from being a nerd brain aspiration, so go on ahead, play until you win. Masterful maneuver. A well-played game of chess can make a sim's mind laser focus. She wants to make a wish, and I totally forgot that I do have a wishing well, so can she make a wish? She can wish for better grades, for a youthful vigor, she can wish for skills, wish for simoleons, wish for romance or happiness. I guess that if she does make a wish, it would be for happiness. Yeah, I'm gonna make her make a wish for happiness. Oh, making friends. I really want to be friends with someone, but they don't seem to really want to be friends with me. How can I make them my friend? I don't know who she... Oh, she's asking Dave. Okay, so he would say just keep being friendly or make one grand friendly gesture. I guess that he would say just keep being friendly. If they don't like your kindness, just don't be friends with them. Find a better people. Okay, everybody is hungry and like in the kitchen waiting for Dave to finish his food. Ooh. So oh. come and grab some dinner, my love. You can actually eat together as a family I can't believe it okay yeah I don't think Zari will make it before they're done oh there she is magically appearing okay Dave is done oh well things like that happen and now she's left on her own which is fine because she enjoys being alone although she's really tired come on eat Eat so you can go to sleep. Oh no, Mint's spirit is fading away. Mint's connection to the physical world is growing weaker with each passing day. Oh, no my mom but we live on through the years. Where are you even go- oh. Just leave it be. Just leave it be, please. She was gonna collect like all the dishes from the house. If she does that, she's gonna go to bed like at 6 a.m. She can discuss logic puzzles, so I'm gonna do that so that she can work so on her grim. school. Speaking of handiness, is there nothing that you can fix? Oh, you're very, very tired though. Okay, why don't you just come brush your teeth and then maybe in the morning we see something to upgrade. Oh, she's miserable now because she's very tired. Although she is enjoying talking to her dad who's also wearing a mask. That's our trend in this family, okay? Oh, Stop taking seriously! Who's calling Rose this late? Hi, Rose, I'm calling to let you know that Shingo has passed away! No, really? Shingo, oh my god! Rose just does not get a break now, does she? By the way, I gotta get him to work out a little bit more for these last three days because he's turning into an elder soon and as you know, I don't like my elders like working out. I'm scared for their life. Tomorrow we're gonna make him do that. I don't know if actually they work. Yeah, Rose works. And Dave does not, so okay, Dave will get to do the things he loves to do as an adult before becoming an elder. Okay, she collapsed in, in front of the bed again. And also, she wants to chat with Makoa. Makoa, it's a critical time right now, and by the way, I don't even know where you got this outfit, but it's not what I gave you, okay? Don't give new outfits to my sims. I'm the only one who can give them to them, okay? This is my outfit. That's all. It's done. By the way, Sparkles passed away too, so the house is like so much quieter now. I'm gonna get Azari a pet, but that's gonna be like when she moves out, so... You're gonna find out in the next episode what that will be. Okay, Zarya has woken up confident. I'm very, very happy about that child. So she's gonna write in her journal and maybe... I was thinking that you could work on your logic and by the way... Ew. 
What has happened here? Why is this so dirty? Oh, you have to clean it. Okay, you can clean it and then continue working on stuff and maybe she could craft some objects. Another day, another entry. The pen hitting the pad really helps Zarya relive her memory, getting it all out. Really cool. Oh my god, it's also harvest. This is perfect rose. Take a vacation day. We can celebrate as a family. Go ahead and take a vacation day. She's also depressed because she's unknown again. Nobody knows of her because she's not famous anymore. And also she's mourning from losing Shingo. Don't be sad, Rose. Go sell this to a collector. I don't I don't even know what this is. And then you can like draw some more art so you can help out your child. Why? Her house? Houses are expensive, okay? Okay, so we need to decorate. Holiday gnome. Give the respective gifts to the friendly gnomes in hopes of festive rewards. And also, we have to cook a grand meal and thankful spirits. Spend time to reflect and to be thankful. Who knows what tomorrow will bring? Well, okay, that sounds that sounds actually pretty nice. In fact, you know what? We can invite a Jay, Justin, Leinani, and the kids and everyone. <gasps> We could do a thing in the garden! Okay, do we have enough chairs? Like Jay and Prisha, Rose and Dave, Justin and Leinani, the kids are like gonna hang out here. I'm gonna grab some toddler stuff for them, just for an hour, maybe not actually. No, no stuff for children, but they can like watch a slide. Okay, that sounds amazing. Can we actually do an event or something? Okay, we can! Um, okay, I guess it would be like a house party. A house party involves drinks. I don't know. Maybe a dinner party! Okay, this actually seems better, this dinner party, but we're gonna do it tonight. We're just going to get ready for it. Okay. Okay, she's feeling depressed, so maybe I can make her ask for some advice. Ask for some reassurance, maybe. Oh, Zari wants to come and grab a serving. You really are eating Italian meatballs for breakfast? That's not Okay, Rose is going to be cooking the grand meat. I think she should cook a turkey dinner. Also, I want her to bake. What oh, she can cook together with? Should she cook with Zari and Dave? She can cook with both of them? That's so much fun! Okay, but I feel like she'd be the only one doing this, so... This will be actually good for Grey Generation because she does need to be very close with her children, so... <laughs> Amazing. Let me just make her... Oh, she just appears out of nowhere. I don't know what you're even doing. Okay. Let's bake. The, are these all the things that we could bake? Okay, look, look, why don't we do some brownies so that we have dessert? There's a dish in the fridge, very nice. Okay, why don't you have yourself some breakfast, some oatmeal? It's almost Zari's birthday, yes, I know. Okay, Rose has acquired the bake skill. I hope you do good brownies, although she's also depressed. And she's thinking about mint. You're not making this easy on yourself. Oh my god, did you see that little yeah. thing? What? Oh look, Dave has taken initiative and he's actually working on his own without me having to make him do it. Go on ahead, work out, do, do an endurance run, continue sparring. He can practice sparring with Zari. Yes! Practice... Okay, he couldn't. Okay, maybe I can make you do that later together. Oh, there's a fire? No, 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 no. Extinguish! Extinguish with freeze ray, come on. Look at how depressed you're doing it. You could have died. Thirteen. Thousand? Are you kidding me? Our freaking stove? No freaking way! We received five thousand and as insurance payment, but the thing is thirteen thousand. Oh my god! Okay, Rose is too depressed to be cooking, so I'm going to make her go cry it out in her bed and maybe take a bubble bath. And Zari, I'm sorry. Apparently, the heavy lifting is left to you. You're going to cook everything for tonight, which is uh. Some dessert and a grand meal as well, please. And why haven't you eaten yet? She's miserable thinking about the fire. By the way, there should be gnomes around the house. But I don't think I'm seeing any. And I do need some because I could sell them. Oh my freaking god, Zari is gonna like starve to death. She cannot actually cook these grand meal things. Okay, Dave, it's, it's up to you now. Okay, Dave has unlocked the indoorsy lifestyle. What does that mean? Various benefits when doing indoor activities prefer to be indoors, decreased work performance in outdoor careers, and tends to spending too much time outside rather than inside. Okay. He is loving the White House life, guys. I mean, look at this cookie. He is so freaking pretty. Run, baby, run and be careful not to fall. Dave literally just saw Rose in the kitchen and was like, oh, hello there, baby. She feels like a competent cook? Competency in the kitchen has filled Rose with confidence. Well, maybe not fulfilled. Splash, let's say, yeah, splash. You started a fire. Like, like, what? Zari, while that's going on, why don't you come 
Why can't she upgrade? She's far too uncomfortable. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? And she's gonna be uncomfortable to watch the stars, right? Okay, this is still silly to me. There is... It is just unholy not to be able to watch the stars while tense because I feel like... You'd feel better if you watch the stars. Okay, there she feels energized now. Great. Uh, we could upgrade. We already have like good money. But at the same time, I don't know. I feel like it's too much money to lose. And we do have to move out Zari in like two freaking days. Two days, guys. Two days. So I'm going to make her upgrade some stuff. Can she upgrade this? She can upgrade the water flow with something. She's going to upgrade these two sinks with a steady faucet. Sturdy faucet. So you know what? You can observe the sky a little bit. It will get your logic skill up and you need to work on that a lot. And also, of course, on your handiness and your aspiration. That's why I'm upgrading like randomly some objects around the house. Okay, Jay, what's the hangout? Of course you can hang out, Jay. There's no question. Can she upgrade the TV? She can! With fuel cell and energy efficient device. Okay, do that both do both of these things. And I think that will be it. And we'll have fixed or upgraded five objects. Which means that the only thing left for the aspiration would be to reach level 10 of logic skill. Logic skill is tough. We know from Mint. So I'm taking my time here. Although she did help us a lot as a child because she completed the Whisket aspiration. Which meant... Oh, she reached handiness level 6. Yes! See, this is what I'm talking about. She can gain skills faster now. Zara can now craft dining tables at the chairs at the woodworking table. She might also find rare electronic parts from salvaging. Yes! Baby! Continue upgrading! I love this! She's so good! Her house is gonna be all upgraded and stuff. I can't wait to move her there, you guys. We have 19,000 already. In fact, Rose, you're depressed. Come depress yourself with a sad painting. Come on. Dave, by the way, you too, like... Find a good way to make me money! Okay, Zari is still very happy upgrading parts. That's awesome. Rose is coming to start talking about money. Maybe she's going to tell her like when she gives her the house that she has to find a way to make her own money because she won't be working. She has a week of university, <laughs> so you know, she's gonna be studying, not working. Maybe I could get her like a part-time job, but we'll see. I'm not very sure if she's the kind that would like that. But she can also like, I have a woodworking table there, so she can like craft stuff and still sell them so that was a way oh, for me Georgia. to think of her oh. gaining money also you guys can tell me in the comments below for some ideas for me to make her some money when she lives alone but that's like what do we get there okay there's time okay she doesn't have enough parts anymore okay she can't upgrade the tv but can you like upgrade a chair what else could you upgrade my child okay, something was happening to my camera i don't know but anyway, and by the way, I gotta start hosting the dinner party. I don't know who cooked. Okay, Dave did make a dinner. He made excellent turkey and normal brownies. Yes, baby. I love you. Brownies are for dessert. So I'm gonna place like oops, the food here. Okay, so we gotta start the event now. Zara's like gonna continue doing things around the house and whatever she wants. But you know, she's just, she's just a weird child. She likes being alone and enjoying her solitude. Okay, by the way, I still see no gnomes, and usually they're everywhere. Okay, we're going to do a dinner party. Host, all three of them. Okay, we're inviting Krisha, Justin, Jay, Lily, I guess you can come too, Nani. Their children are missing, why can't I invite their children? Okay, it's gonna be at my house, but we're gonna have to manually invite over the two children. Oh, look at her! Into her party outfit, baby, yes! Okay, there's little Frankie, so can we invite him over? Oh my god, look at Zari too! She's in her party outfit! So mad, but so beautiful! Okay, and Dave too! I'm gonna make these. Okay, can we all go here together? Okay, there's Prisha not wearing her usual outfit, so I'm gonna change my love. It is currently warm, so I'm gonna put your nice warm outfit. Oh my god, you look amazing. She's gonna form a group of Lily, Prisha, Frankie, Justin, and Jay. And also, we need to invite over Jamie. And the thing is, I still do not know the kid of Leinani and Justin. So I'm going to be having to like, um, I'm gonna have to teleport it here. Okay, I know her name is 
Thalia. So I'm gonna try to look for her, but I don't know her. Actually, I'm gonna summon a sim then, right? Oh my god, and we have to get Josie as well! Josie is the third child of Krish and Jay, so yes. There she is, she's also here. In fact, Rose, why don't you come do a friendly introduction and we need one more baby. You guys, I can't find her, this is so hard. One child, where are you? There she is, Athalia Savea, okay. It took a short while, but there she is. Okay, before the festival or the dinner party starts, I just want to slip into cats and give her a makeover, so... I'm gonna make Rose introduce herself to them both before I head into cast and then we're gonna see how Thalia looks in cast because this is so exciting. Leinati and Justin having a kid. I mean, I've never felt this happy in my life. Okay, they know each other now so I can go into cast. Wow. So this is the father of the beautiful baby. Oh, look at him. He is so freaking beautiful. There is the baby. Actually, I wanted to see the wife first. Look at Leinati. She's so freaking beautiful. What is this outfit, honey? What is, what is going on? Oh my god, how much I miss Justin! But okay, let's give a makeover to this little princess! She's also going to grow up to be super, super beautiful. Okay, so this is little Thalia. This is the child of Leinani and Justin and might I say, she also will grow up to be super beautiful. I am so freaking happy that this family has spread wide and why? I miss Justin. If my challenge would have been to continue with the firstborn heir, he would have actually been my Roseberry Sim, which actually I'm not sorry about. He is super amazing. He's a muser though. He's not like a super romantic like Rose. The only girlfriend he's ever had in his life is Leinani. I can't play with her, but I don't know if she's pregnant again. I hope she will be again because look at her. I love her so much. Okay, yes! This is little Thalia. You can tell me what you think of her in the comments down below. Oh my god, look at Zari and little Frankie talking. Get to know him. Okay, there are the two newest toddlers. Okay, come on. You're already doing a mess. Just don't get any on your dress. I just gave it to you. Okay, so we have Lily, Prisha, Josie, Frankie, Jay, Thalia, and Justin, right? Although I don't see Leinani. I don't see Leinani. Where's Leinani? Is she heading in? Okay, I don't know if she is, but can she call everyone to meal and eat? Grab a serving together. Oh, look at baby eating next to the table. Oh my god, they both are. Double trouble babies, I love them! Okay, Zara is very tense because stranger danger. Loner can't stand to be around strangers. Who knows what they might be up to, but honey, this is your family! What are you even saying? Come! Come to a friendly introduction to your cousin! Okay, Rose is desperate for a wee. Maybe after that, you know what you could do, guys? Why don't you slide some? Just, just slide the slide. Slide with... Prisha with uh, Dave, with Lee Nani because she seems sad, with Justin, with Hazari, with Jay. And apparently with Frankie who's here. Yes, I saw Lily there. And no, I'm not sorry that I did not press her. Okay, Zari, I just want you to know your children. That's all. No, no, not your children, but your cousins. They're your family, okay? You can't be treating them this way. Oh, little Frank is already taking advantage. Okay, Zari is feeling really tense. She's not even there yet. Just a little bit more, child. Oh, they're hugging. I didn't know you were on that kind of terms. But oh my god, Dave! What are these muscles? Look at them looking at each other. Yeah, go Rose! Yay! Okay, it's your turn, hot stuff. Yay! Okay, be careful with the child. Okay, you just went right through her. Okay, yeah, babies, have fun! In fact, whenever you're all guys ready, you can grab some dessert. This was like quick, quick food and dinner, but... It is what it is in this family. Okay, Zari is eating and feeling very, very tiny. And she really needs the wheat, so why don't you come continue working on your stuff for your aspiration, okay? Who cares about people? You know what? You should get your logic skill up. Did you clean your machine? You did. Come and practice analysis then. Okay, and it's also like 11 p.m. Oh, sorry, Dave, that seems painful. And the children will need to be going to sleep, although little Frankie is enjoying our hoop. But I'm going to have to end this early and say goodbye to everyone. Okay, it's not the best harvest fest, but we got to see our family, so I'm going to take that as a win. Oh my god, you guys, gnomes! I want to sell them. Okay, I'm going to sell you guys, I'm sorry. Are there any more? 
Did they give us just two? Well, that's fine. It's all written really fun. Okay, everybody is heading home. Okay, you guys, I'm glad we had some time together. Although we weren't really all together, I couldn't form them as a group and get them all to eat together, but they still saw each other, you know? They got to meet all the children. That was important. I wanted to meet Thalia and Josie. So, okay, Josie didn't like us, frankly. I don't know. But I want us to know, like, all our family. In fact, do you not know Janie? The other twin? He doesn't. She doesn't know Janie. But Rose should. So there is actually our family tree. We have Justin with little Thalia. We have Jay with the twins, Janie and Frankie. And now also Josie. And Rose only had Zari. Lily hasn't had any kids yet, but she's like a young adult, so there's time. Okay, how's the logic going, Malone? You're almost to level 7. Okay. Maybe get to level 7 and then you can head off to bed. It's been quite a day for you. You've seen too many people. Okay, she's also finding some new elements. Oh, which is fun okay we have two of those so let's sell one it's for your house okay okay we have 20 grand and she is turning into a teenager on sunday right oh no it's on saturday <gasps> i can't count the days okay yeah right okay so she's aging up tomorrow on saturday and also rose and dave's birthday is like two days after that so i guess on tuesday we will have their wedding because rose does need to be married as an elder for the first time that is part of her challenge so we're gonna be doing that on tuesday but it will be like after Hazari has moved out and stuff. So, okay, yeah, Harvest was not awful for everyone, but still. She is feeling very focused from this interesting result. Oh, she reached Magic Level 7. Now she can read Advanced Logic Books. Okay, I guess that means that she can read the third book now. Okay, I'm gonna get her the third book and I'm gonna make her read it tomorrow morning. Okay, I need upgrade parts, you guys. I really do. Okay, we got some stuff. You can throw this away now. Everybody will be going to work today. Okay, everybody's spirit is fading away and I don't care. So, Zara needs to upgrade one more object. Can she upgrade this somehow? I'll just open this pencil, yes, so we can get this part of the aspiration out of the way, which leaves me only with three levels to go of logic, which probably won't be this episode, but I'm still gonna grind. In fact, I'm gonna make her read a logic book a level three to see how her logic skill will be going up. And also, you know what gets her logic skill up? Observing the sky. So you can do that too as well, Malone. Today's school does not matter for us. It's literally actually her last day of high school. I don't even think that she'd want to go in the online lectures, but I will make her just a little bit. Like, maybe I'll skip it. Which means I have one more day to collect double of what we have. So let me think. Okay, so I'm just gonna check, like, little stuff that I can delete around the house that will make me some money. Like, maybe this thing here. Two is too much. You should have one. It's for healthy reasons. Okay, I'm gonna delete this as well because they never use that. Okay, we have things in our inventory that I will sell before I leave. Actually, looking at all those stuff, you know what I think? I think I'll get the money. I think I'll actually get the money, but let me still see if there's like things we can delete that we don't need. So that th some of this money can go to Rose and Dave for the next time. Okay, I'm gonna delete the pictures of the previous president or whatever she was. These pictures creep me out, so let's sell them. Okay, and I think this is it. She reached cooking level 6? Wow. Okay, so after you do that, you know what? The upstairs room of your dreams is waiting for you. Okay, Rose brought home 3,700. Real nice. Okay, we're getting enough money for the house now. Yes. Okay, Dave is back with some more money too. This is great. She's gonna have money at her other house that I created that you're gonna actually see. You're gonna see my first ever build, guys. I'm so excited about that. Okay, she spent like her all afternoon practicing analysis and now it's nighttime. Oh my god, so freaking beautiful. I'm gonna miss this view. I asked a mutual friend of ours for your number. They owed me a big favor. I hope this doesn't make you feel uncomfortable. I just find you really interesting, Zari. Do you wanna meet up today? Okay, first of all, it's like 10 p.m. Second of all, I don't have any friends, so I don't know which mutual friend you're talking about, but no, thank you. And then again, I'm not into humans. The only thing that Zari finds interesting and beautiful are aliens. You guys know that. Okay, Zari is heading off to sleep as her last night as a teenager, guys. Last time in this room, sleeping in this beautiful, beautiful room. But it's okay, I'm gonna take your stuff with you, don't worry. 
In fact, is there anything like most important that I should take? I feel like a picture of her mom and dad would be really nice. Oh, look at this. A horse sculpture. It's worth 20. Wow. Okay, this is her birth certificate. Okay, this is actually Zari's birth certificate, so I'm gonna actually be placing this on the wall, like this. Actually, that's too high. I wanna put it in the middle, but I can't, so... You know what? I'll put it here in the center because Dave loves to look at this. And also, mint thing! Mint a print from the sky for Rose. We're gonna put that too. In fact, we have to give Zari all the inventions that Mint made. She gave them to Rosa, she could give them to Zari, so I'm just gonna place them like... Oh yeah, I don't have BB move objects on the Y. I'm just gonna place it in Zari's invention. There you go! She has everything from her grandmother now. She has the wormhole. Okay, Zari's woken up stress. Techie withdrawal. Zari hasn't been spending enough time with technology lately and it's starting to mess with her head. Okay, it's really tiring to make her go like downstairs for everything, so I'm just gonna put in some stuff that I'm gonna delete later. Course. This might be like super weird, but I'm doing it anyway. I'm placing two things here. Give her a nice sink. And also, of course, I can give you a bathroom mode because you don't need to go all the way downstairs to go to the bathroom. Okay, there you go. You have everything now. You can live here if you wanted to. Okay, this has gone on long enough. Sorry, come on. Cook yourself a cake, which is bake yourself a cake, but it doesn't matter. A matcha tea cake. Have some cereal, go to the bathroom, get ready for your birthday. I just want to get her to level 8 before I age her up. By the way, I forgot, you need a stove for this. So I'm gonna give you a stove. Oh no, it's too late. She's gone down to the downstairs kitchen. She keeps trying to get away from me, but no, you're gonna practice analysis right now. You know what, at this point, I think we should just like age her up without that logic skill because we will be maxing it out, so it doesn't matter really. Okay then, Zari. Come down here, you two baby birds, come here. It is time for your little lady to become a grown woman. Hey, what are you doing? No! Uh -huh. Are you kidding me? Rose, what happened to you? Whatever, this this family is too dysfunctional for me to think about it right now. But there you go, Zara blowing out the candles. There you go, baby. You have turned into a young adult now. Let's see you. Have you changed? I don't think you have. No, you're still super freaking gorgeous. And there goes your dad being happy and your mom being like, oh, hello there. Aging up beautiful lady. Okay, the last thing I have to give her is the ambitious traits. Which, might I say, I don't think I'm seeing again. Oh, there it is! I'm so stupid! She seems gain powerful moodlets from career success, gain negative moodlets from career failure, and may become upset if not promoted. Okay, we're giving her the ambitious trait because it's the final one, and let's head into cast so we can give her a little bit more grown look. Oh my god, Min sent Zarya a gift. Are you kidding me? Alan too! Alan is her half- I have no idea what Alan is. And Josie has sent her a gift as well. Oh, cute babies. Okay, our baby is a young freaking adult now. I actually had some hair ideas for her, although I did not download them because I am stupid. So I gotta be honest, I really like this hair on her. It really looks beautiful. It was like on my thumbnail on my previous video. Okay, so she's just turned 18 and she's getting ready to head on to live in a way this so her style is gonna be something like that. And as I said, I see Harry Potter vibes in her. And I always, always will. Oh my god, I'm really tempted to give her something like this, but I don't know. I don't think like this is her style right now. I really gotta see some of her new CC. I cannot believe that. She's honestly quite difficult to dress. I honestly don't know what to give her. This is actually kind of cute. She's gonna head in university now, so I guess that kind of look is what I'm going for. Oh my god, look at Rose's hair on her. She's so cute. So this is Zari, ready for the world, ready for university, ready to get started on working as an astronaut because that is her dream. As you know, she wants to visit Sixum, so yes. I guess in the next video, we'll be starting off with me moving to Oasis Springs into the house that I built, so be sure to subscribe so that you don't miss the video. I'm very glad if you stuck by this far. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to catch you in the next video. Bye!